Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, no, nigga, no, no, nigga, no, 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 nigga. Yeah, you on that bullshit, yeah. nigga. Hey, I'm the yeah. way, man. I ain't watching that shit, nigga. But if y'all do happen to check it out, this shit a good, nigga, shit a good show. That's the fucked up part. I've been hearing the shit good. The shit good, man. I seen Moneybag do a parody. That shit was dead on. That shit was. We gotta get Charles the White back up here, man. Yeah, that nigga there, man. Man, that nigga fun as a motherfucker, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nigga. You laying in your bed, nigga. No, you watching me, nigga. I bet your bathroom dirty, nigga. I bet all y'all niggas in the comments right now got mold around your tub, nigga. Go wash your tub, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I might not agree with all that shit Charles White be saying, but his word choice be sometimes. Ooh, he was gooey. He was gooey. Yeah, I don't agree with nothing he says. That nigga hilarious. Hilarious, nigga. I don't agree with nothing. They asked that nigga about the WNBA. They said LeBron James make more than the whole WNBA. He said, yeah, yeah, don't nobody want to see them dark holes. They won't give up no pussy. They don't want to give, ain't nobody spending no money on them hoes. They keeping that little pussy in a circle. That nigga had me. That nigga, they had funny than a motherfucker, man. I what he said about Lil Durk. No, no, Lil Durk ain't no bad motherfucker. He got a fat white baby mom. <laughs> what the fuck? He got Bro, you know what's <laughs> fucked up about that? Once a year, they put that picture out. Bro, I don't know. That girl ain't like getting good ass ass mom. He, he like his good love with it, too. <laughs> He got a what? A fat white baby mama. He said, For you real? can't. Hell he, yeah. He said, you can't be a bad motherfucker with a fat playing, white baby mama. We recording right now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> this is public information. I didn't yeah, know but that. I'm saying, yeah. I wasn't privy to that information. Clayton got, Clayton got his screen you shot. Doing on the he was the who you follow? You said who I follow? Yeah, I mean, I, I miss that. You know, you it's so much shit on the internet, nigga. You don't, you got miss. No get, you don't follow your real family on there. Yes, I do. You get them cousins on Facebook. I just don't be on, on Facebook like that. Get shit. your ass on Facebook. I don't be on there, man. I, get on my, there. I, you I'm deserve to be on there as a comedian. These jokes right they got them self. The thing about it that fucked me up on Facebook is once my mama got on there, right? This is a true story. When my mama got on there and I saw my her and my cousin Shell, you know what I mean? Used to been beefing my whole life, right? Mm -hmm. They always was beefing. And I got on there one day and they was arguing and she said some shit about me in the argument and I was like, this shit took me back to then. I was like, oh, I'm never getting on this bitch again. You can't <laughs> escape that shit, nigga. That shit different. If you go on there and your people's arguing and say Who some said shit. said something about you? My mama, nigga. Your mama said something about yeah, you? Yeah, because she said not bad, oh, but okay, about she you. was referencing they argument and referenced me in the argument. And I was like, oh, nigga, hell no. Nah. Did she tag you? Yeah, she tagged you. No, she ain't oh, tagged oh, me. Okay. I just seen it. You know what I mean? I seen the argument. I was like, I'm getting off. This Son, day. I need you in this one. Yeah, Man, nigga, hell hey, no. Nah, what nigga. about that time? Nah, she don't win. win yeah, nah, hey, they, yeah, right, exactly. You get on there, imagine you get on there, your mom and then argue with your auntie. Yeah, that's why your son pissed on yourself till he was 12. Nigga, you're like, ah, nigga, it's true. I do too, need bro. to stop getting on because I'm petty. I don't never, I realize I don't let shit go. You gonna ask, request me to be their friend? I'm like, I know this ain't the nigga that stole my Gatorade at the gym. <laughs> <laughs> we are not friends, nigga. I ain't like you said, 94. Yeah, I feel you. Some of that shit you just write people off. Once you do certain shit, yeah, you out of there, buddy. Not a Gatorade. That ain't no be a petty. But That's you just, know what I was thinking? He wrote thinking. his own ticket. I'm gonna ask y'all this. I was thinking about this, man. I think it's a blessing that our generation didn't have the internet as young as, you know, our mm -mm. children had no, the internet. No, because we had it. We had it first. But we didn't have it like that. Nigga, we couldn't use it. It wasn't in real it. time. But now we're getting to see all the shit that we needed to see when we first had it. Uh, yeah, exactly. But I couldn't, I, I just think about certain situations, right, in life that I went through. If I'd have had a Twitter, nigga, I remember a bitch broke up with me because a nigga handwriting was better than mine. If I had a Twitter that day, <laughs> nigga, the tweet I would have sent out out of frustration, I can't believe this bitch that broke up with me because Randy Curse was better than mine. This nigga shit on himself twice in class. Now, I'm, you know what I mean? I mean, like, you can't, we couldn't have had that shit that back then, bro. That shit, anti-bullying and all that, what you saying, he shit on himself two That's times? That's a lot of pain. See what I'm saying? You let, you still hurt about that. Yeah. Oh, nigga, still. That shit fucked me up. And, I thought my hand right That nigga started practicing his curses like oh, a nigga, my, hand get... write, my hand writing is immaculate to this day, because we both wrote yes, this, I wrote two yes, no, maybe so letters in my life, and that was one of them, and we both wrote her a letter. She made us write her a letter to ask if we wanted, if she wanted to be our girlfriend, and she, and she looked better at mine. And looked at that nigga, she was like, you write better than him. I'm going to be your girlfriend. I was like, bitch. Bro, you won. What Randy at now? I don't know. Where that girl still at? Doing well, but what if he's still doing better than you? I Randy, like a successful now. lawyer, he done sued the Oh, government. no, we good now. Now, I love to run it to that nigga now. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We could be cool now. But back then, I was like, nigga, fuck How the girl look now? 
I, I have no idea, my nigga. After no, this, you I will. I have no idea. After yeah, this, she you gonna will. Hit you. Yeah, I ain't even gonna say her name. Just yeah, you ain't gonna be able to see hey. shit with me. Uh, it's just gonna be naked. I, I didn't know there. what I was yeah. doing in fourth grade. And you know what the fuck that part is? I might still fuck just cause, nigga. Like, I don't give a fuck what you, you would. Like, Spin the block. Might as well, nigga. Third grade trauma, nigga. Fuck it. They say you're supposed to address that shit, nigga. I'm gonna knock that yeah, shit out. That's why I like that. <laughs> that's why I hate being from a small town. They say you're supposed to address your childhood traumas, nigga. I might knock it out just to get it on off my Yes. That's why I, I hate being from a small town. I can't even tell y'all all the type of shit like that that I done been through because the statute of limitations ain't up. These motherfuckers are still walking around. Tell us one, though, man. I can't. Yes, you can. No, I can't. Well, you can get five, one Because this is going to be a goddamn emotional town. Come on, come yeah. on. You got to take Hypothetic. one. Hypothetics. Switch names one. up. That's all you got to do. Say no names. The people that's there know the situation. Yeah, that, but you ain't like, saying nah, no names. Like, I know you nah, talking about. You got to give us one, Lowe's. Give us one. Just Let one. Let me think about it. Go ahead. Continue the conversation. Man, you give us one. I heard about the line leader shit. Man, that shit ain't true. But look, on Facebook, they done came up no, with... You no, you just got to move with. past that with me, my nigga. Yeah. What, what's the story? The women that like you, they call themselves the beanies. The what? The beanies. <laughs> For real? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah it's, on, it's Facebook. on Facebook. That's why I'm telling you you need to fuck with the Facebook. It's like a whole cult group that's yeah, fucking with you. Your, your old the lady beanies. might be on there. Word, yeah, the beanies. The beanies. It'd be a few little bad ones on them. not babies. Is that like a copyright issue? Or is it what? Nah, nah, it's a few little bad ones. Now I've seen them. You got a few little bad ones. Oh, a few? Yeah. Just a couple. What's the rest of them? We already oh, screened them out for you. A word? Yeah. What, what's your group called? The Millerettes. <laughs> Nav done already hit him up and told him that he he run your Facebook. Nav got a Navy. <laughs> Nav got a bunch of burner Facebooks. And Clayton got the English major. Yeah. yeah. Okay, you you're an English major. So oh, yeah, you're English major. What flash is English majorettes. English majorettes. Flash is the, uh, the flash. And I got, I, I got, I got something here. <laughs> Man, it ain't it the flash. Ain't the flash, because he the shit. Hold on, I'm finna find out. You know, you got separate divisions. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got separate. So, some people fall into the category. Everybody, you know. I'm gonna find me a girlfriend. Some people is the Wapazonia. It's gonna be social the media or all these Wapazonia. Or something. What's the Wapazonia? Just what it sounds like. They got wet ass pussy. Oh, the Wapazonias. No. No, they Wapazonia. Wap. Yeah, you oh, got when you put it all together. Damn, it bro, back. that shit probably too far down. They post too much on I mean, it. Oh, damn. I'm telling you, though, I'm going to date one of them words. ladies out the comments. I'm going to go through there and find the finest one on all the social but media. that probably ain't the best one, though, the finest one. I don't give a fuck. Hey, you might Sometimes have Sometimes you want to go out to eat. Sometimes you want to have ice cream, nigga. So you just worried about being seen in public? <laughs> I ain't worried about being seen in public. I'm just saying, nigga, this is for some no, it's a social experiment. Yeah, that means something that, you know, it's good in the moment, but it might not necessarily be good. You focus. caught me? You caught me. Huh. I mean, hey. You know what I'm saying? You know, you, it's, it's tasty to the moment. Nigga, you can't eat delicious. a plate of candy for dinner. You can? Too much yeah. of your favorite shit. Nigga, 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 you got to be fucked up. Nigga, yes, you can. Nigga, nigga I had sour patch. Nigga, I had some no, baked Skittles. Nigga, 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 and DC wives are called the Fly Gals. And last but not least, Clayton wives are called the English Majorettes. Congrats to us, 85 South wives, nigga. See, that's how you know we're going to be successful. We on the internet like Jim Jones, nigga. That's crazy. <laughs> no, now, that's how you know we're going to be successful. You see that? What? Our hoes is broke down into subcategories. <laughs> we ain't never going to fall out by no women. Man. So it's like everybody got their own division. Them ain't, you go through them women, them that they don't, they not even the same kind of women. Mm. The Different motherfuckers calories. that like him, like him. That's all they yeah. like. The yeah. motherfuckers that like him, they like him. And that's all they and like. And they were gonna like me regardless. Exactly. They just might not have seen me. Mm. You understand? Even if I was even if we wasn't doing this the same, women would gravitate to you. You just might not have enough pool to get them to come and at one you. time. Yeah. yeah. I don't know though. They keep telling me, like they keep suggesting Brazil. Damn, lady said I'm a. They telling me to go to Brazil. She mix all the names we together. She said I'm a, Mal go. I'm a Melini Fly Majorette. Oh, she's a slut. <laughs> <laughs> she's a slut. <laughs> Ain't no way she that like all that. That pussy smoking. <laughs> Ain't no way she like all that. Then the next one said I'm a Beanie Millerette. Oh shit. 
Why she couldn't be a Miller Beanie baby? I mean, hey, that's just how you do Put it. Put my shit first. I told these hoes about not putting me first. <laughs> hey, what two should I say? Treat me like a pimp, even, even if I ain't got, got no hoes. Come on, Bro. now. Church on the move. That nigga Bean, that nigga finna upload his Facebook Boy, tonight. Man, I'm not getting on this shit, my nigga. Thank you to all the Beanie babies out there. She ain't even going to go to work. English But I'm not getting on there, man. Where the Beanie's at? Catch me in public, I show you all. I'm gonna go ahead and expose you, but I'm not Chico. On all these motherfuckers keep hitting me and be like, tell Chico to check it. I'm like, that nigga on here. He's just lurking. Lurking. I be actually saying shit. He be lurking. I don't never lurk on Facebook. No, I don't lurk Facebook, nowhere. No. I, don't, I don't. You be, be on that social media. I, I, I be on there sometimes. You know what I mean? You but have your moments. I have long moments. I go in spurts, nigga. You fuck around to get get your hour and a half straight. What do you do as scrolling. opposed to that? What Everything you be up else, to? nigga. Everything else. You know how to knit, don't you? Everything. I know how to do a whole bunch nigga, of you know shit, how to nigga. knit. I be cleaning up, nigga, washing clothes, driving around. That nigga probably around, got the best nigga. yard in the neighborhood. Uh, that nigga, nigga probably got meticulous shit, yard out here, right, nigga? <laughs> that nigga out there with the He the type that uh, nigga, with the <laughs> head trimmer, nigga. This nigga edge in the neighbor shit. I just yeah, couldn't yeah, stand yeah, to yeah, see it. Stand like, stand like, so I wonder what type of other secret occupations this nigga got. He a beekeeper. Yeah, exactly. Nigga, I'm an Uber driver. You fuck around, catch me driving Uber, nigga. You know, I'm one of the top rated niggas in the Country. Nigga, district right. manager for Popeyes. <laughs> right. <laughs> nigga be dressing up in his the button. Nah, nah, the nah, the shop shop he button. can't be no district manager. He gotta own a few franchises. This nigga in the program or something, nigga. You gotta be there too often to be a district nah, manager. Yeah, ain't no way. Some obscure shit, nigga. I fuck around and got three staples, nigga. You, <laughs> that nigga mystery <laughs> shop on the weekend. Hey, you ain't, hey, you ain't even gonna know till you need some shit. Xerox, nigga. Hey, man, just running my uh, my branch down there. You know what you doing here? Oh, yeah, I bought this. Yeah, that's, that's my this staple. Thing this right me. Here. This me here. That uh, nigga got a shop What's wrong, printer? You print yeah, yeah, you, you print it down, man. Yeah, don't even worry about it. I take care of it for you. But see, the, the, the thing and the reason why I, I don't, I can't get on the social media like that, because that shit, man, you'll get, you'll get that rabbit hole, my nigga, and then you'll be into some shit, you fuck around, see some shit you ain't want to see, nigga. You know why I be on that shit? It be like the comedy club. That's exactly what social media remind me of, bro. That, the comedy club. In what way? Like, Bro, you remember going to the comedy club before anybody gave a fuck who you was? Like, they didn't know if you was on the show or just a crazy nigga at the show, right? Right. It remind me of that. Now, see, I just will Just the say type it. of shit that you can see in passing, like, the conversations you go over here, the shit that you gonna see people do, it's just like, nigga, you grown, and you still do this look at me ass shit? Yeah. It be amazing to me. Yeah, see, the thing is, I, I think will you gotta say, come to it with the right mental, though. Right, you I come be, to it's it all bullshit shits and giggles to me. I and mean, you gotta good. avoid it to keep your mental. Stay the fuck yeah. off yeah. of it. Yeah, no, it ain't yeah. even that I gotta avoid it yeah. to keep my mental, it's just that I done already found the shit that I'm interested in, and it the social media never broke my interest in that. You know, some niggas had shit that they was into before it became popular mm. and that overtook it. Yeah. The shit that I fucked with before it was popular, I still fuck with the yeah. same, so it never overtook it. Did but, you ever fuck with comic books? Nah. Oh, okay. Nah, nah. 2K, you know, man, you don't fuck with that? Nah, I don't, I don't really play the the, uh, the sports shit like that. I do fuck with the video games, though. I like the, the shit like... Uh, uh, Assassin's Creed. Mm. I'm one of them type of niggas. Dude. God of War. God of War. That, I can't wait till that come out, nigga. I like to shoot shit up. Yeah, see, but I like, I like to go online and be an asshole. Hey, man, I'm just gonna say this. And, and you know, ain't nobody got to jump in there with me, but man, Grand Theft Auto, man, fuck y'all. Forever, nigga. That game I'm been out. I ain't gonna say that, because I'm gonna be on the next one. That game been I'm gonna be on the next one, too, but fuck y'all forever. I've been out for 15, 17. 2013, nigga. That bitch came out in 2013. Come on, man. What Come they on, need? Man. They might need some actors. They need a fuck. We do the voices, nigga. Had an '85 South first of channel all, on Grand Theft Auto. First of all, it, it just get me down there for get us down there for consulting purposes. You ain't got you to play down, but Slink, if you want to, Slink shit. Slink should have had downloadable content. Slink should have been a playable character. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. He was supposed to be. This is right. the rumor I heard. He was supposed to be. That's why the wheel where you pick your characters got to empty. It was supposed to be four instead of three. And it was Slink got Slink. locked up. And they had to like move For forward real? with the project. That's what I heard on the Dang. internet, but I ain't heard it from. But see Slink, the fuck, so. the fucked up part is we saying this shit, and the only him. nigga to get the opportunity be Nav. He don't tell nobody. He working on it now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're starting to see how much of it. You can use an old word on this nigga. A scumball he is. Man, he's scoundrel. Real scumbag. <laughs> 
<laughs> he wanted all to himself. I you just got to get him drunk. He just slip up and <laughs> I ain't got to get shit. That's how he be getting over on motherfuckers. He always come around, and then you got to give him some. You got to get him drunk. I ain't got to do a motherfucking thing. He should have came drunk if he wanted to be drunk. I ain't getting him shit. Bro, he got movie star money. Get us, get the weed and shit supposed to be on you. Tell him about the show, man. Oh, shit, my bad. I don't even know where we're going. Hey, April 30th, we will be in Denver, Colorado. Oh! Theater. Please. Right. Three-headed monster tour. Hey, you yeah. nod. Did I say it right? Yeah. You're in Denver, Yeah. They gotta get to me. I ain't smoke none what yet. Gonna put behind us on the green screen. That's three headed monster. Three headed monster. Put your bitch behind me. <laughs> put your bitch you know, behind me. Three headed monster. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Denver, April 30th. We got a big storm coming from the left, and we're gonna bring it down. It's called a three headed monster tour, and they're Fact. gonna come in and they're gonna sweep the whole city. Fact. Right. The left, that's the west. Put your bitch behind me. I go with that one. Yeah. Uh -huh. They don't go theater. Look how get done. We back. Yep. You bitch. Yeah. I really got a three head monster. Ooh. You gotta go to the hospital. I, I, I did. <laughs> Chief, what y'all think about what? John Moran just in general outside of basketball? Outside of basketball. <laughs> outside of basketball. Yeah. Outside of basketball. He could have a. a he can have an extreme a extreme record. record. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, I saw that nigga could have been right now. Right now. Could have been right now. I saw that motherfucker could have been right now. If he wasn't with the lead. Yeah. If he wasn't with the lead. Yeah. If he wasn't with, the lead. He wasn't with Drew Lee. He got a whole show with him. He know how to dance. That's what I said. He could dance. The nigga got guns already. That, usually. I wouldn't call that a gun. <laughs> Damn. You, if you can hold your gun like this. He had him on plastic floor. <laughs> Man, I would have been the army in the league. And they had to track me. <laughs> he had a gun. Uh -huh. He had the gun Tony got. He <laughs> said, said John Moran had to track me. <laughs> <laughs> on your mark. <laughs> You, you, oh, you jumped when Tony. You jumped. That motherfucker. You jumped when he shot that gun, though. Yeah, yeah, ain't lying though. No. Yeah, nah. Tony, Tony got that shit, man. <laughs> you know what they say? The small guns got the got the bullets that travel through you, though. Hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie. So don't sleep if, on John. If somebody, if somebody would have just like try to rob me with that, I know I would get gangster. Like you would think you watch the snowfall. <laughs> Shoot me, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, you tough? <laughs> but no, man, it just oh. You have man. a hell of a rap career though. You right, bro? John ja Morant. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Easy. Yeah. He, he might be alright. He but got like, a different. He got the colorful dreads. Yeah. Looking like little Uzi. His dad support the hell out of all that shit. Hey, that's what people. His dad out the chain. Yeah, his dad don't give up. Hey. Fuck. Is his dad still with his mom? I think so. No, no, no. He hey. bought. He bought. He bought them a house. One of the houses across the street just for his dad, the other one for him and his family. So he, he still stays in the with same cul de sac. Yeah, yeah. See, that what that was going on. He, mm -hmm. His dad is still hitting his mama sometimes. He don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's what I do. I break down all the facts. <laughs> but you know what I'm doing. You ain't doing what I'm doing. I'm on Pride Pit right now, my boy. I'm trying to wager a wager. I ain't even going to lie, man. They got so many deals on here. You ain't got no trouble but to win some money. Need to go on here and sign up and kick it off like Draymond. Listen, but you get it? Kick it off like. But you know what? I'm a big stepper like Draymond. Uh -huh. <laughs> 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 nah, but for real, prize pick. That's where it is, man. Yeah, man, I'm trying to tell you, man. Listen, man, they got so many different situations on how you can get some money. You and they still account. matching whatever you uh, deposit all the way up to a hundred. You got to have one account though. Yeah. Okay. I, I I tried to tell you that last time you ain't listen. I ain't know. You know I was still on my hood stuff. Off only valid once. Right. What are you waiting for? Go ahead over to Prize Picks right now by tapping the link right there below and tell them 85 South sent you. Hey man, make sure you go to Prize Picks and sign up and register so they can match your deposit up to a hundred dollars. And use our code, 85 South, man. I'm telling you, when you sign up, they're going to give you that money. So when you sign up, use your account, use our code, go ahead and pick the play, man. They're giving you free money to get some money. No, look at me. Would I lie to you? For real.
Never mind. But I'm saying, though, this for real. This ain't got nothing to do with us. Just we got a code so they know that you know us. Prize picks. You know what time it is. They got the deal on top of deals, my boy. Get you some money, man. Don't you want some money, my friend? You want to get you some money, my man? Get you some money. Bro, let me get quiet. Can you still, like, can you still contact Eddie Murphy? Nah, I, uh, me and his assistant, we chat every now and then. Uh, Which assistant? Um, he lying. We hitting this man with them shade rooms. Federal. Put that phone up. Federal. That's his assistant, Federal. Yeah, Federal. This nigga got a name like a villain so, in a superhero movie. I, I be sending him. Isaac like, Federal. Isaac Federal. <laughs> I be sending him the clips and shit. I told you what? that motherfucker be lying. Nah, so. he be sending them clips to himself. Hey, man, you see me open up the Savannah? <laughs> Knock him dead. I'm ready for the next one, baby. Hey, man, who were those guys at the end? Oh, them niggas work for me, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're my guys, man. I'm just looking out for them, man. You know, I put them behind me to get them the opportunity to shine. Oh, I sent you the name. one with them on it. <laughs> ain't niggas in the whole bit. Hey, you niggas some cold niggas, I'm man. I'm just fucking with you, man. Continue to your, do your thing, man. Big Love movies it. and shit. I want to see you in goddamn on one of them Madea movies, a Big Mama's house. No, I want to see, nah, wanna see you in the live action Fat Albert, nigga. Hey, nah, I want to do some the, shit. The, the, the new one. I want to do some shit like Top Gun, that type of shit. Oh, you want to be a hero, man? Yeah, I want to be. You gonna be in the play? Nah, I want to be the nigga, the action nigga. Bro, I was thinking about this. I'm gonna let you jumping up and down, all that shit. I think. <laughs> do you do that now? Like no. The roles that's gonna <laughs> come nigga, available I'm get like ready that. for the movie. They gonna have to fuck with us. Like we might have to play like some cops. You know what I want to do? Some shit that ain't not even not even close to some shit we want to do. Like they gonna have a show about like some black cops and some shit. And Did we you gonna see the, shit the Baltimore the corrupt cops by the dude that made the wire? Oh yeah, yeah. I that's forgot what it's story. called. Yeah. But that, that's some that of the best crazy. content on the internet. I love to watch crooked cops and cops that broke the law go to jail. I watched the whole trial. Oh yeah, the whole trial. See, I want to do a movie where I really got to stretch and, and really get into a character. I want to be Captain mm. Save a Ho, nigga. I want to do a movie where I'm just saving hoes, nigga. Not like a real superhero, but I'm talking about really Give saving. Give me a scene. You want to be simping. Yeah. Give I'm, me I'm a scene. You want to be simping. That, that type of shit, like a motherfucker. You, you walk in on her, she getting piped down. Yeah. Train but you ran still want to get it. Train ran on. Oh, you still want to get it. He the nigga who stopped the train. He I go first, the and then he go in there and tell her, you don't got to do it. You don't got to do it. Oh. That type of nigga. I'm talking about the nigga that do this do. She oh, come in. Pie, she come man. in. She come in. All right, everyone. Everybody it's over. In. Everybody out, okay? Everybody, so do you, do, you walk, do you walk her out with a blanket around her? No, nah, not even out? that. Before she, when she about to walk in the room butt naked, oh. I put my hand in the middle of her chest and say, hey, you're better than this. <gasps> I can see that. And, and then put my finger under her chin. Look she, at me in my eyes. She got it. You're better than this. <laughs> And then put my arm around there and hug her. All right, right there. Why, 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 why can't you know, While he hugging her, though, while he hugging her, though, she looked back over her shoulder with the thriller eyes. <laughs> <laughs> like, I still fuck. Hey, that's, yeah, that's the movie it. right yeah, there. Yeah, I'll write it for you. You want to think day. Hancock. Think Hancock, man. Without using yours. With a, exactly. Mm. The movie Hancock. Yeah. Hell, what you talking about? No, I'm talking about because the Look, cop saber hole never fuck. He don't use his cop. Right. He, he just a cock blocker. Exactly. Right. What are the niggas saying as you exit? They trying oh, to take him out. I'm fucking these niggas over. Like, these niggas, I'm talking about, I'm calling their baby mama on them. Oh, All type man. of shit. Oh, this Captain shit get worse. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah, nigga, I'm one scene. About, it's one a scene, movie, nigga. You just walk in and hand a nigga the phone. <laughs> On FaceTime. FaceTime. Exactly. FaceTime. Oh, exactly. he right here? Tell hey, the truth, big dog. I see, here he is. I'm talking about, I see a motherfucker. That's horrible. She, That's worse than she, 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 She's sitting outside crying. She's like, I don't know why. I don't know why he treats me this way. Like, let me see your phone. What's his social media? Hacking to the nigga DMs and giving oh. all the information. Here's the person you're out here crying over. Be married and walk me, away. Me, man. how if it start like this, a nigga try to put you in his life, like, uh, he said he was with you, Chico. No, the fuck he wasn't. Right. Straight up. He was fucking off. And her name is this. Oh, the nigga bust up in the wedding like the Joker from Dark Knight. Oh, do somebody have he any? He bust up in the wedding laughing. <laughs> <laughs> you think you know who you marry? You think you know? Nigga hit the button and the screen Boom, come down. The point come down, nigga. That's what I'm talking about. He playing the porno from last night, right? <laughs> Bachelor party, nigga. In front of the mama here. Yeah, the mama. How you get drunk? 
Captain Some Sabo. Some people have their grandma there at the wedding. Tell you. Front row. Village. I'm talking about oh, playing not my baby. a role that is completely different than who you are as a mother. That's how you win the, uh, the Oscar right there. You do that type of shit. Denzel Washington training day, but, nigga. But, like, you know how sometimes people can't get out of that role. So, how, what you gonna oh, do? Oh, no, nah, that's what I'm saying. That's a great actor. You know what I mean? You gotta be but able I'm to But I'm saying once they get locked in, it's hard for them to get out of that role. Yeah, sometimes yeah, you gotta yeah. go there and then you gotta deal yeah, with it. Yeah, it'd be hard. Yeah. I'm gonna let y'all land on some shit. I've been working on it. It would be hard to get out of it. You know hey, when Rick Ross came, I started working on this shit. What's that? This nigga, you know a nigga had to teach the government how to cook the crack, like the street way. Yeah. So the most sold out nigga ever, the nigga who came up with the actual crack rock formula, the one who developed it, the nigga who perfected it, the nigga who took all the chemicals and shit, and then was like, no, nah, all you need is some baking soda and some hot water. The nigga. nigga who made that shit readily available for the street. That's why I say, that's why I say it's a fucked up theory, but I believe this. I believe baking soda is one of the worst products to ever hit the black community ever, nigga. You know like what? what's in that shit? Wrong way. But it just still, yeah. what's in nigga? You, you can the wrong brush way. your teeth with that shit. Exactly. You can put exactly. it in your refrigerator, Keep nigga. It fresh. You can do all types of shit. It's safe it enough. What is it? It's my safe nigga? enough. It what is, is it? For baking soda, it's baking soda. Boom. And this is a perfect time for me to tell these folks. Welcome back to the 85 South Show. Yeah. Now we are speaking on we 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 just black man shit today. Man, come on, man. We just talking about black man shit. So you might not be able to relate to all of it. This ain't had. This has no rhyme or reason. These are just black man theories that we came up with in our minds. Hey, one of y'all intelligent people that be in the comments of the 85 South Show, y'all 85 percenters, can we please find out what exactly baking soda is and where it came from? Right. That's the motherfucker we need that to make a movie about. That shit clean jewelry, too. The almond, it baking clean soda everything. Do everything. It do everything, but baking you can soda. bake, you baking can bake soda. biscuits, you bake with it. You make cookies. Cookies and shit. It's baking soda. What? Uh-huh. Told you. So basically, and carbonate. So basically, baking soda. It's baking soda. It's all one. Now, thing. It, it, ain't, it ain't one element. But now check this right. out. Don't get it fucked up either. Because baking it's soda, sodium you just said you can clean car batteries with the shit. Putting them bitches together is more than one. Clean car what? batteries. The molecules and shit. Come on, boy. What I, I knew you was the line leader. It's that, it's, it's that English major yeah. shit. Yeah. Right. So what I'm saying though is baking soda, baking baking soda know, is not baking powder. You point to it. Two totally different things. That I do know. And dollars. What we gonna call it? Got my dog Clayton English in here. Nav Green. Yeah. My dog, Nav Green. I'm gonna play a part in the Chico Bean. My motherfucking maestro that always got some pimping playing, J O N. J O N. J O N, you mic'd up today. Oh, you bullshit. Man, go get Mike. Man, speak with your outside, boy. Man, go get Mike. Because no, they, the they always want you to say something, and they act like we got you on restriction. Right. Even when I just want to do it again. Like I, I do it quarterly. Yeah. You put a mic on this nigga. Y'all yeah, still don't y'all say shit. Yeah. So they know yeah, that it's not. talk like that nigga. Why the fuck you kids still know? J.O.N. talk like he used to ride around with Quincy Jones before he was famous, man. He got that type of Yeah, man. Yeah, man. It was me and J.O.N. riding around. Yeah, We had two white bitches from Estonia. Yeah, man. That's a story. Man. Yeah, man. It's so, it's so, it's so crazy, man. Yeah, yeah, man. And Jay went come in. Yeah, 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 man. You know. Uh, he talk like the nigga that be agreeing with pimps. <laughs> <laughs> I can dig it, baby. I, dig it. I dig it all, baby. How far do you dig Everything it, baby? You, say, I mean, man, when you drop it, I'm gonna dig it up. <laughs> That's what it is, man. Big cat in the building. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta throw this out here, man. Shout out to the 85 percenters, you know, just for staying active in the market. You understand? Yes, sir. You know, they got a whole Facebook group, about two, three hundred thousand people in it, and they, huh. they, they dissect this shit. Yeah. They say you it's, know it's gonna be a good episode, Chico rub it leg. Oh, yeah. Rub it knee. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I, ain't, I ain't even know they pointed yeah. that shit out. I don't, I don't know if the nigga on the X pill or what. I ain't. <laughs> nah, nigga, it's just I got that restless leg syndrome. They you used do, to make bro? that commercial about. I think I do. I used to see it all the time. Yeah, you can't be, like, be still. Bro. I, got, I think I got that restless leg, my nigga. What's that word? They say fly always use infrastructure. Yeah, it was shit. That's his shit. That's his shit. Man, when I saw that, I died. The brother brain that work. I don't know. It's the infrastructure. Man, hey. You got to build the infrastructure. You can be talking about some regular.
like legit was like, ain't gonna say something about that infrastructure. <laughs> well, I'm tired of hell. Yeah, the infrastructure, man. <laughs> That's his shit. Right. That's his shit. How y'all niggas living, man? So I'm living day to day. I just know some shit about to happen. Now I'm, I just always think the shit about to pop off. What shit? It's a, it's, a, shit. It's, 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 it's a play. It's different levels of shit. So do you think the shit, the shit, or just some shit? The shit. Oh, the Lord government Jesus. type shit. Oh, mm. Lord. Thank yeah. you, man. I'm just saying, man, this shit too, everything too fucked up right now. What you think they gonna do that they not already doing? You know, if an old black man looked at the situation of the world right now, you know what they say, hold on, young blood, back your bus up. That's exactly what need to happen. It's too much going on too goddamn fast. Everybody's doing too much. You ever been in a store where niggas start stealing and they don't know who's stealing, but it's a couple people stealing and now the whole environment just like, hold on, it's just too much going on right now. That's exactly how I feel about this whole situation. Uh. I don't think the pandemic is over by a long shot. I think everybody buying all this shit that they're gonna end up having to sell ass and suck dick for later on. <laughs> I'm telling you, nigga, they have sold all the Lamborghinis till next year. You can't even ask for a Lamborghini to 2024. Rolexes too. They have sold all the Rolexes. All the Rolexes are they gone have around sold the world. All the Ferraris. The, the shit that costs the most is gone, nigga. This is, I don't know what the fuck about to happen. That means some shit that, that some shit that's about to come out gonna be more than the most shit that ever was, nigga. They gotta come up with some shit that's more expensive because niggas is buying the most expensive shit in bulk. Where all the fuck this money came from? PPP. You know where it came from. Now shit, I'm telling you, bro, the dollar ain't gonna be worth a dime in a minute. And they fucking, they fucking these motherfuckers up because the people who got money got a whole lot of it. And the people who don't have none ain't got a goddamn thing. Right about that. The gap big. The gap. It's a few people with gap. a lot. It's a few people with all the money. So all of it's one percent about with all the but goddamn money. But the thing money. is, it's always been like that though. That's what I'm saying. That's, that's the what thing. I was talking about. These motherfuckers been gave they separate. That's how bad the, shit is. Them buying up all the expensive shit. So what you saying? What you think about that? Like what you? What's your theory? That's gonna raise the price of regular shit. All right. May 20th. Where we going? Louisville, Kentucky. Man, to the who? The KFC Yum Center. We ain't got no KFC yet. But it's gonna be at the Yum Center. Is it, is it Louisville or Louisville? It's Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, it's Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, Louisville. No cap. It's Louisville. They nine in the back. I need, I need KFC to bring us it's, some chicken, bro. Is that close to the uh, Kentucky Derby? It's in Kentucky. I mean, but is it close to the day that we're going to be there? Hey, man, fuck all that. Bring me some bluegrass. For real. <laughs> is Bubba Johnson going to be there? Bubba Johnson? Yeah. That nigga, Bubba Johnson ride horses? He the NASCAR. Can, Kentucky, I thought that was a car. No, nigga, that's... <laughs> Hey man, come to the show. Come to the show a little bit. Bring the horn. Ignore what he said. Yeah. Ah! You can come. Yeah, baby. That's the best car, girl. Yeah. I thought he can't take a derby with the car. No, that's. Ah! That's the Daytona 500. Nigga, nigga. Derby. Ain't nobody told me. That's why I won't take you no fucking way. Hey, man. That's get, what? get your tickets. May 20th, KFC Yum Center. Shit, take me to the horses then, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you got that, yo. I always thought a kid take a derby was a horse, I mean, with a car. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Lex P, and I have a very special announcement. Well, I already announced it, but I'm gonna let y'all know again. We are going on tour. It's starting in June, y'all. Look, we announcing it extra early so y'all got time to get your tickets. No excuses. We got LA, Philly, Chicago, Atlanta, Houston. Now, listen to me, because I know how y'all get. We are still adding dates. I repeat, we are still adding dates, but if you see your city right now, go ahead and get your tickets. If you don't see your city, don't worry. We still coming, okay? So make sure y'all go to www.poorminds.com and get y'all VIP meet and greets. We all side, poo. I mean, regular shit already going up because inflation. You call it, it ain't went up yet. Uh -huh. No, it's went up. Not yet. It's I'm went up. The shit that's coming. What you, you asked me about? was about to happen. I know shit happening. Gas happened just it. dropped. Up. Shit is high as it. Nigga, ain't gonna be shit to put no gas Holiday. in. That's what I'm saying. But you know what they do? They shoot that gas up. Holidays, travel. No, they just shoot it up high as fuck, and then it'll never, it'll never drop as fast as it shoots up. Mm. Like every time, like think about how gas done went up when it was a dollar forty something a gallon at one point, right? 
And then it shot up 2.30 or something, right? Then it dropped down to 2. It'll never drop back to where that shit. Yeah, that what? shit ain't gonna like, never drop. Yeah, they, say, they say it takes I remember uh, growing up, it was 78 cents yeah, for the record. Then, then, uh, they man, say uh, gas take off like a rocket and come down like a feather. Like the prices. See, so the he, prices, been, he been studying. Yeah. He I knew what the topics all. were. You gotta start sending me the topics exactly too, bro. That's exactly how that shit be no, we, what, what topics? The, the, the topics don't we, of the show. You think no. we got a worksheet we hand out? Yeah. No, no. This, uh, this is clearly on topic. Oh, okay. I don't know we where said we just talking about black man shit today. Whatever, we black men, so whatever we come up with. You just don't like when yeah, you I'm don't just know. saying, y'all niggas just look a little bit more prepared than me, that's all. You <laughs> always look unprepared. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You don't <laughs> like that shit, nigga. People keep <laughs> asking me about your mental health. I think it's time for you to look at the camera and let them know how nah, you Nah, nigga, it's time for y'all to delete all that footage. That's my a footage. classic commercial. Man, Bean, see, Bean, you don't know. Let me tell you how dirty these niggas is, man. All right. What they do to He you had know. a mental health ad he had to do. OK. So I stuck around because I had to chop it up with him after. OK. He shooting his mental health ad. No, Joe no. paying the camera and show where, me. Where were you sitting? Bro, I wasn't even sitting by the nigga. But well, where were you sitting? <laughs> On the other side sitting. of the room. OK. So, so Joe take the camera and show me why he talking about <laughs> if, you're, if you're battling mental health. We got a number you can but call. I'm sitting there chilling. What was you doing? Pull Look the it. ad up. Pull Look. the ad up. Pull it up. I got to see it for myself. Show me the mental health ad. Show me the mental health ad. The mental health ad. When they have been it, so, so he I had to pan to you. Well, he panned to me. But, but like, see, but great time out. Time I, out. I'm not gonna shit on him. Great di direct work, <laughs> directorial work, great directorial work. But I shouldn't have been part of that shit. But time out though. See, you, the way you're speaking about it is as though you was just sitting there on the phone or doing no, something. Right? He was doing nothing. Whatever you he was, was doing, doing nothing. No, 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 no. Man, I ain't gonna lie. Whatever you were doing, you I look, was, you I look like I was looking lost. Oh, all right. Well, there you go. Well, say that first. Don't no. Leave, don't leave. With the, with the nigga did you wrong, leave with I. First, let me just say, I was going through something at that moment, and he caught me. Let me fuck you up right quick. Now, you can't tell me that Chad don't look like Michael Myers standing right there. Oh, yeah, he definitely look like Michael Myers. Look at him. He's standing there with your hands on your hip, nigga. This fuck you going through, man. <laughs> no, you're not just chilling, bro. You're struggling. Why you shit like that, man? Man, shout out to Chad. He gave me, like, bro, no fried foods. No eating after a certain time. That shit still ain't working, man. Bro, we just started. You was a negative nigga. No, no, you, you know you're not just starting. You? Bro, we I'm not 14 gonna let you, days you clean. You lying, my nigga. Bro, we are 14 we was, days nigga, clean. Nigga, do you forget we, me and you mm -hmm. had this conversation in the lobby in Dallas? That was not 14 days ago, man. We, we no, wanted you this nigga, you ribs. crazy in September. He posted some ribs the other day. <laughs> Since September 1st. Since September 1st. No, 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 no. How you switch the date from when no we was in Dallas? I ain't said we gonna eat ribs. The ribs was fried. No, that was the grilled ribs. No, nah, I'm not about to let grilled you. Grilled ribs. Lois, you right about this nigga. I didn't want to believe you. You right about this nigga. I be trying to defend him. You right about this nigga. Because I personally was in the lobby with you niggas. And you would say, yeah, man. You know, I you know, I jogged the day. You know, I ran me some miles a no day and everything, man. I ain't been eating no fried foods. Been I drinking never said that. Did. Yes, you did. Me, I probably was drunk when I said that. I probably was drunk when I said that. Now you gonna blame that. it on alcohol? <laughs> yeah, cause how was it my fault that stopped. you was drunk, nigga? I stopped. It was my fault that you was drunk. I didn't. I don't know you drunk, nigga. Man, I, you I, was regular. To I, me. What, what I tell you? He tell you the truth when he drunk. <laughs> well, he telling me a lie when he's sober. I know. He, I mean, it, it, I know. Y'all nigga tripping. Man, listen, man. We gotta figure it out. Well, hey, I was hey, trying to compliment Chad. Department. When was we in Dallas? In damn near July. <laughs> when was we in Dallas for the 85 South Show? Man, Ryan don't do shit he, good. You didn't get into it with this nigga, man. Nah, nah, because I don't like that shit. I tried man. to warn you before I don't we like got that started. Shit, man. That's fucked See up. Yo, That's fucked up. How man. long we been on our journey, bro? July 30th. July 30th. Right. What about you said that? on July 30th, you said, yeah, man, I started my diet. Oh, wait, no, August 13th. August 13th. Uh -huh. uh, you said I started my diet. It's been a month. Today is what? Today is the, the today is the 14th. It's he been a month. Wait, 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 wait. You're trying to get him to admit that he What me? B, you might be right, but I relapsed before I started for real September 1st. See? <laughs> Bro, it ain't no, you just can't wake up and go clean the straight way. Why was you talking like you did? I, he thought, was I, I thought I was. 
Quit the game, Cole Turkey. Oh, this nigga. Now, poopy. see, you thought no, I'd be hard nigga. on you. <laughs> and this nigga ain't giving you no goddamn no, swag. Man, that but shit, I'm back. Man. I ain't got no sympathy for no, that nigga. You gotta really do that shit, bro. I'm, I'm here. No, I don't know. Nah. You gotta Back really to do what, it. Bro. No fried foods, no bread, no alcohol. Hey, what's that nigga online that be talking? Uh, the, the workout nigga that be talking crazy to motherfuckers. What's my man's name? The uh, the, the he be cussing niggas out when he were the. I can't remember his name. Big bald head dude. Yeah, motherfucker. Oh, you ain't Cali Musk. Yeah, nigga, you need a nigga like that with you. Yeah, bitch ass nigga, you'll never get swole doing no whole ass shit like that. Know, that you, need shit. Yeah. you need a nigga like that. Nah, that nigga gonna stop going. Yeah, nah, nah you need that type of motivation. Pull that fire on that nigga ass, boy. You better watch your no, goddamn No, you ain't never mouth. gonna lose weight if you gonna shoot a nigga for no, trying to make you lose weight, nigga. No, I'm just saying if he bitch ass nigga, you ain't gonna be doing all that. Nah, I ain't saying bitch ass nigga. I'm just saying stand on you. Oh, yeah, he could be yeah, disciplined. Right. Yeah, yeah, you're not But Lowe just said he was gonna call me a puss ass nigga and he all would, that. That's how he talk to the folks. That's how he talk to the folks. Hey, man, ain't gonna be too many more bitches. And then you doing push up, struggling, you here, bitch nigga. Like, I don't know. I might just lock up. I mean, yeah, but you ain't gonna be, you ain't gonna be able to fight that nigga. You gonna run out That's of That's why I'ma go get that. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga just shot a nigga at the gym, my nigga. <laughs> Lie, man. Bro, I'm telling you, if you want motivation, man, if you really want to do that shit and lose Why weight. Why you turn into his motivation? Because I'm mad at this nigga, man. This nigga really sold me a dream in that lobby of that hotel, I man. Been, I, I was, was believing do. in that Listen, nigga, man. What you want him to do? I was still, I'm still running my mouth, though, but I was still thing. drinking, though. But I, now I realize I got to stop drinking, too. I didn't know you was as drunk. I'm not a drunk. <laughs> I drink. <laughs> let me see. Let me see. OK. I'm not a drunk. Oh, that's I a drunk. old ass, I have a too. drunk. This from back in the day. Let me see. Let me see what you was looking What's like. What's up, man? Mental health is a real issue, which is... Man, just watch this shit, bro. Oh, my Look God. Look at that shit. Why the hell? My, I didn't get not an ad dollar. I didn't know what he was shooting. Why is your my name and me? Yeah, man. Mental health is a Hold real up. issue. Hold up. Your mouth was open, wasn't it? <laughs> Hey, what's up, man? Mental health is a real issue, which is not often discussed in our community. Post-traumatic stress, depression, all types of things could possibly be going on. <laughs> now, Ben, you being neutral. That shit ain't dead ass wrong. Show this shit like a book to elementary school students. <laughs> Look and Lowe's be saying when them niggas ask him right now, <laughs> mental health. He's talking about, I don't know. <laughs> Nigga, you do know. I got you fucked up. Look at his mustache. <laughs> <laughs> Right here. Take this back. That one's got kind of fucked up, bro. Hey, they could have edited that out. Shut him up, Shut him up, Just hold it. Let him get a zoo. Oh! <laughs> they realize they're to you. Bro, you see that shit? No, that's why you seeing it. Then the nigga, look, let me tell you how dirty your buddy bro, is. Why you got the Charlie Chapman, though? Why you got this? Why your mustache look like that? Bro, I don't nigga know what the Listen. This your buddy now. So when I confront him about this shit, he talking about some nigga, do you know how many people seen that commercial? I was like, what you That's mean? No nigga, I put I put you into these niggas' homes. These niggas seen you. You a household name now. But it mind fucked me, I say appreciate it, Los. But I really shouldn't be in Okay. That's why we gotta work on your mental health, my nigga. And for that reason alone, for you not to pick up the this nigga and just finesse you out your own mind. Wait, wait, wait. My whole point is you an actor, right? <laughs> Tell me where your career went after that commercial. I start getting calls and <laughs> <laughs> I be looking out too much. I mean, if you look out too much, you become the lookout. Yep, that's true. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. Or oh, as they say, you build a motherfucker up for him to go against you. Mm. Mm. Nah, I never go against my dog, though. <laughs> Bro, you on like four tours. But which which one come first? <laughs> I don't know. Whichever one got the money. Whichever one got the money. He nah. work with any fucking bad. <laughs> no yeah, intent. man, you know what I mean? I got that live Paw Patrol I'm hosting, man. <laughs> I don't know if y'all knew, man. My man Nav opening up for Paw Patrol, man. Got him a little dog suit and everything. He play a, he play a pug. You no, know what I mean? He come out in the pug suit and I introduce the Paw Patrol. I be locked in with the man. He trying to lock in with Vlad so he can expose her. Oh, I, no, oh hell, hell no. I hell never do no, never shit, no like shit like that. Like that. Man, don't yeah. even, ooh, don't even <laughs> speak that type of shit. Yeah, wait till it drops. Yeah. <laughs> 
Cause you gonna, you gonna see that nigga. Cap, <laughs> man, you niggas weird, man. <laughs> I mean, how, why the fuck would he pay to me? <laughs> <laughs> the cat wasn't even on me. And then I go, I go talk to the nigga Lowson. Right, yeah, then that nigga Vlad gonna be asking you. So, uh, mental health is a really, really big issue. And you had an issue when uh, your uh, cohorts panned over to you in a, a shot that you were disgruntled about. Let's let's talk about that a little bit. You gonna go right into it, ain't Nah, bro. Yeah, you gonna, you gonna I'm like, nah, that's all I love. Clip. I, know, I know how to do that shit in interviews and shit, how to... You do? Yeah, yeah, be like, hey, nah, it's all love. Yeah. Give me an example. When you had to do it, so, so they be they be trying to get you. That's had what to I was do about this? to say. Yeah. yeah, I done had to do it before. A few times. Yeah, a lot that of. That nigga got a Breakfast Club interview in the cut. Don't put this shit out till I give you the word. Man, <laughs> 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 the whole. He went, on, you, man. he went on funk, funk flick. <laughs> Drop the bomb right now. <laughs> give me one of Clues bomb. Yeah, all the way, man. Oh, this man. nigga bad boy hit us with that flash from the five heartbeats. Yeah, man. Get my album. It's lonely at the top. Drop it next week. <laughs> See, man, he done convinced you that no, whole life. No, no, he didn't convince me you did. You convinced me you was on a diet in that lobby that hotel, nigga. No, bro. I told you I was getting better. I never said I was on a diet. I said, I what you, you said. You were strung out on the food. What is it, man? What's your struggle? Bro, it, it don't be that. So, say for instance. Cakes, pass. No, nah, it's not even that. It's like, okay, I be doing good, then we get to the show, the venue. Y'all yeah. have all them snacks, all the oh, fucking can on. Oh, you hey, like I didn't flip. say it. You, you never said. gonna get nowhere blaming other people. I'm bro. not blaming anybody. So, you I said, I said, Watch don't how put... how easy this is. Ryan. <laughs> I said, don't put it in my room. Hey. And I stopped. I don't eat, I don't eat the snacks no more. Nothing but room temperature water. Get him some of them vegan straws. And fruit. Oh, no. A, a fruit cup. <laughs> Nigga, fruit healthy. A fruit nah, cup. Nah, but you're not, not about to get... a fruit cup, even the one that come with the lunch. <laughs> yeah, a cup. Not yeah. one of them. Not a spread. The cup. one that come with the lunch, go the little small one. They got two peaches yeah, and a grape in that out of hand, hey, no. Put some, get some, uh, some one-a-day men's, too. No, no, he needs some vitamins. Man, get that nigga some flaxseed oil. Yeah, he ain't yeah. had a mineral in his body. Yeah. In the, boy, you no, 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 look man. like he needs some B12. Yeah. No, I'm good, man. I'm, uh, I'm actually been getting better than since Vitamin September first. I'm saying, like, what, 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 what is your eat schedule like? So between, I'm doing the intermediate fasting. No, that's not even. That ain't even a word. I know you lying, my nigga. <laughs> that's not even how you say that shit, my it's, nigga. It's, okay, ready? We filming. Hey, nigga, hey, pop, your hey, nigga hey, pop your shit. Hey, homie. Pop your shit. Pop your shit, homie. Oh, homie. Pop, pop your shit, homie. Yeah. Weird ass nigga. Yeah. Real player. Real oh, player. Let's Hold up, my nigga. You yeah. being hella boosy right now. Hold up. Hey, nigga. Pop your shit, homie. Uh. You already know what it is. Nigga. Luke 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 throw that shit. Throw that shit up. Pop your shit. You pop my piece for the wannabes. Yeah. Pop your shit. I might be there. I might not. Yeah, it's enough. Show him your cookies you brought with you. Nigga, look at this. Hey, nigga, they got cookies as a carry on, nigga. <laughs> cookies got shake in the bottom. You ain't never had no chocolate chip shake, nigga. What day we going? Mama's, nigga. June 4th. What fuck you talking about? Oakland Arena, nigga. Yeah, nigga. June 4th, three headed monster tour on Cetus. Nigga, on, nigga, hey. nigga on your baby, nigga. What the fuck you talking about? I ain't Hell never seen your baby. Hell of niggas, nigga. Hella out there. Hella niggas already got their the bitches are already out there, hella, nigga. Hella bitches. Hella, hella bitches, bitches, nigga. Hella Not few, bitches, but a hella. Hella. I ain't bitches. never seen hella. Nigga on the tail. It's gonna be hella bitches. Oh my mama, nigga. Oh my mama. Oh my, on Cetus, nigga. Hella oh my town, no cap. Nigga. And two is not hella. What fuck nah, you talking nigga. about, nigga? Get your tickets, nigga. June 4th, nigga. Yeah. Town business. Nigga. Uh, what it is? Three headed monster tour. Mm. Yeah. Show them the cookies. Cookies, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mama. Somebody's mama's made these. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nigga. Yeah. <laughs>
is intermittent <laughs> fasting. 12.30 to 8.30 in my cutoff hours. 12.30 to 8.30, that's all fucking day. How the fuck you get that? 12.30 to 8.30? Eight hours. Eight hours ain't all day? Hell no. Not what I, compared to what I used to do. You used to eat all day? Oh my God. Nigga, it might be, when I leave here, I might go home, get a little snack before I lay down. Eat what's what's, what's a snack to you? Uh, a sandwich? Either start off with a bowl of cereal. A start. That's, oh, how, you, that's how you warm up. <laughs> then if I take my bowl downstairs to put it in the sink, I'm like, oh, yeah. let me grab a bag of chips. That's how you warm and up. Grab a bag of yeah. chips. In the cabinet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, don't tell, I don't like where this going. Don't tell him shit else. Nah, let him if you want to be let on my 600 pound life, let him go. 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 And once I, once I grab the chip, man. That nigga, that nigga be down there pouring the cereal. Yeah, nigga. That's all you want to put, nigga. So I grab the chip bag, I'm like. That nigga be down there with the French Toast Crunch, nigga. Yeah. Apple Jacks. Almond uh, milk, though. Almond milk. Yeah, all right. I'm good. Hey, man, fuck your health. Hey, man, nah. No we asked about nah, your mental man. health, and then we nah. got into all these dietary restrictions right. and shit. Because nigga, I can't now, be look, out that, that, I was 100 yourself. pounds ago on that. I can't be giving a fuck. I mean, that's good. You that's good. good. You, right. You got to lose that weight, man, because you don't want to be looking back at them old 85 South episodes like, damn, nigga, look at my feet. <laughs> You lost 100 pounds? No, I said oh. I was 100 pounds ago on the, on that mental health ad. What that mean? He gained 100 pounds, <laughs> nigga. Oh, I'm high. Dang. I'm high. <laughs> I'm high. That nigga gained 100 pounds. Since then? I don't pick up some weight, though. I don't give a fuck. That ain't I my do, bitch. Bro. You my nigga, Man, bro. appreciate it, bro. I don't give my nigga, I don't they, they motherfuckers came in here with some J.I. Yeah, friends. Right. And now I look at it. I damn near rolled my eyes like a girl. Like you better not do no shit. I'm gonna get the celery though. No, you're not. Oh, it's after 8:30. It's after 8:30. Yeah, it's after 8:30. You think he's slick? Cause you know the celery got barbecue sauce. Hey, you gonna dip it in ranch? This celery gonna be covered in and got damn barbecue. Nigga be in that motherfucker eating carrots with mustard on it. Like nigga, that just feast the purpose. It gotta add some flavor. See, you you didn't know that he was this type of person. Yeah, I didn't, man. All you gotta do. I believed in this nigga, man. Oh, I was boy. so proud of him. You should have seen how he was, how he was <laughs> giving it in the lobby, man. He was like, "Yeah, man, you know, cause this, this, this lifestyle, man. I had to make a change, man. I, you know, I got responsibilities, man. I got to." Hey, that's what you heard him say. Yes, you did. That's what you heard him say. I don't drink, my nigga. I remember everything too, nigga. I'm an elephant, my nigga. My head ain't this big for no reason, nigga. You was like, "Yeah, man." You know what else you know, he be saying? What? He be out there telling them ladies he our manager. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they had to throw some shit about that, man. Somebody was mad back there. That nigga be the last show. Man, hard. come on, man. You not yeah. out here telling what you be doing. You not on jelly roll promotions, too. my nigga. Oh, you don't know what he doing, doing, oh, no, no. doing the poor man. Oh, no, no. You don't know what he doing the poor man to her. No, no. You ain't seen the clip? Nah. Hey, pull that up. Show, show Chico what Nav wore to the poor man show when that nigga had that goddamn. No, nah, not that one. The other shit. That like, shit is that fashion like over shit. To the, to the, uh, to oh, the anniversary episode. Oh, no, wait till you see this. Oh, wait till you see my yeah, outfit no. this year for that. I already got that shit custom made. This well, nigga. yeah, you ain't gonna be able to wear it if you lose weight. <laughs> this ah, nigga. Hey, think about that you, shit. That's what I'm saying. Who you think you're talking to? About so that? I need to say this size so I can you, fit this you see what he, <laughs> You see what he wear to, to the 85 South show? Right. Oh, right. okay. This motherfucker think he, uh, Christopher Wallace at the poor man's tour. <laughs> that nigga got some spray. Relax and take notes, that nigga. Now, I know the nigga be watching your outfits, because he got some Chico Bean shit. He's going to fuck you hell up. No. Please find it, Ryan. That nigga clay say hell no. Uh, you ain't seen it? No. Oh. What he got on? You don't know this nigga, then. You I do not you seen it, bro. You do not know this nigga, bro. Ryan probably sent it to you. We got a research department, my nigga. No, Ryan do a little lame shit like that. He probably sent the <laughs> shit straight Don't blame my boy. I already Don't know blame how my you, boy. I know how he operate. Hey, man, I'm telling you, bro. This nigga not who you think he is. Man. I know. After that experience in the lobby, him just said, I just started September 1st. That just, that just No, like, strict uh, September 1st. That's look, not Look, Clayton can't said. stand to be a rapper. He got to go. No, yeah. I'm, I'm coming back. Because I, I need to see what he wore. Because okay, I know. Man. It's crazy. Nah, Dad, how many outfits you the want? Yeah. He must be scrolling through your shit. <laughs> nah, I ain't even, I didn't even put that up, so I don't know what he, why he got some shit of me in an outfit. I don't know. 
I you got know, the whole show. I, yeah, I don't like a nigga taking pictures of me okay. on the side if he ain't no cameraman. <laughs> like, what the fuck are you doing? I, we got cameraman. Why the fuck do you got a picture of me and your goddamn dad? <laughs> For times like this, nigga. No. <laughs> <laughs> It's something he need to tell me. <laughs> <laughs> he think everybody working against him. No, nah, man, is, I was with him, You don't, you was... don't turn to everybody against nah, him. No, bro, I was with you. And I think you did like you, to just sit back you, and watch it see, all unfold. Did you see the excitement? Yes. And do you, if you remember what you say you said, do you remember the excitement in my face when I was telling you, you was telling me like, wow. You doubt, you doubt me up and I you, was like, man, I'm so proud. That's what's up, bro. You ran and I was telling you, but we had the conversation. I thought you was lying because you said you jogged two and miles. I showed you. And I said, nigga, ain't no way you was out outside running oh, in that Texas come. heat. Here and you come. said, no, nah, nigga, I wasn't running outside. I was running in the... Let me see. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, no, that's bad. I ain't no, I ain't no. <laughs> yeah, you see it, nigga? Well, you look like you on the hookah lounge. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> oh, oh, I told you, nigga. You do not know this nigga, man. Hey, man, this nigga. What, what <laughs> city were y'all in? Were y'all in Bermuda? Where the fuck was y'all at? Turks and Caicos. Oh. You was in Birmingham dressed like this, man. <laughs> man, you was in Birmingham with this shit on, man. <laughs> Man. When you when he, when he said Colombia, you were thinking the country though. Yeah, that's right. I'm like, nigga, you play, play, no, play. Let me see it. Play, my nigga. Let me see it. My nigga, you come on. Look at this nigga, Let man. Me see it. Hold Look on, at man. this nigga, bro. Boy, if you don't get your head out of here! This motherfucker look like Tommy Rossetti. <laughs> This one, the nigga with. got on, he don't even got on the regular Gucci slides. Man. He got on the African Gucci slides. The ones the African with niggas the with, with the oh, toe sleeve. Yeah. Man. 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 I told you. With the shades, my nigga. I told you. He got on that last last. Everybody go to breakfast. <laughs> Sayo. That's what he was putting. That's what he was listening to when he put that shit. When he put the glasses on, that's what that bar play. Sayo. That shit was inspired, man. Bro, what? You was in Birmingham. And then the nigga got the shit buttoned down in like the second but. Well, you got your chest out. In Birmingham. Not that even, was not Birmingham. That nigga lying about that. That's not even a tropical place. <laughs> Where was y'all at, bro? It was Birmingham. Even one of them places, my nigga. When they oh. said Columbia, Ty, but, I'm a no, nigga. Now, Chico, you it might have been. It might have been. When they said Columbia, they did not put South Carolina behind it. Passport. It just said Columbia. Yeah, it's passport. So when they said Columbia, I was like, well, I need to have some tropical for Columbia. <laughs> they didn't tell me it was Columbia, South Carolina till we got there. So you dress like you dress like a young cocaine dealer? <laughs> <laughs> crazy. Then the fucked up part is the nigga got a pair of socks on that don't go with none of the shit he got on his shirt. Show him, bro. I'm about to show him, man. Y'all got to see this nigga, man. Look at this nigga name outfit, man. Man, pick the better picture. This nigga went to Zara and went crazy, man. Man. He got this shit from you, man. man he, I ain't never wore no shit like this. Man. Okay. That shit look good. Hey, hey, don't call my outfit no shit, though. No, I ain't never wore no shit like this. I ain't never wore no shit like this. I ain't never wore no, like no shit like this. Who man, man? I, I, we got to zoom in on the Gucci slides, man. Then the nigga got on a pair of Hanes socks. Nike socks. Who made them? <laughs> Oh, man. Goddamn. Yeah. How you zoom in, man? How you how you get the, the picture to zoom? Who man? made the outfit? Huh? Huh? Oh. What's that nigga with Eddie Murphy? Nah. What's your name? I got that. Ferrari? <laughs> Ferretti? Federoff. <laughs> Federoff, nigga. That's that nigga got no, no. Federoff, uh, nigga. That actual outfit, that was from a boutique. Uh, yes. You buying boutique stuff? A boutique. Uh, wow. Look, man, man. Let's wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Zoom in on that shit, man. We can't do, we can't do this in front of everybody. Look how but I got more questions for you. Oh, go man, ahead. look how high the heel is. That nigga got that nigga heel, the heel part of the sock is on the back of his Achilles, nigga. Check. That's Let me crazy. See. <laughs> nigga, look how high you got this. Man, hold up, Nav, man. You my nigga, man. 
Chico. What's up with you, man? He be Look how high the hell part of the sock gets on your leg. Oh, oh yeah, that, I think I double socked that day. <laughs> that, that, that was man, I can't take this I shit, told man. You, man. When he get over there, he be acting totally different, man. Oh, this man. all the front. Dang. So I'm just saying, like, yeah. So y'all gonna judge me from a picture, y'all? No. You need the video to see. Bruh. I was still me. No, nigga. I was still talking Bruh. that shit like Bruh. it's me. Ain't no way you had that on your body and was still talking like oh, you was me. Nigga, you, I was talking nigga. that shit. Oh, you always talk that I shit. I seen this nigga on a fly for a show, bro. He had on an 85 South shirt, but he done photoshopped it to make it say now. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you was a fucking liar, dog. <laughs> okay. Bruh, bruh, this, we, you know what? We gotta have these at least once a month with these niggas. With this nigga. A nap therapy session, by nigga. What you got he going on? He just be getting my oh, another one. Oh, that's New York. <laughs> Man, ain't nobody asked you shit. I told you. Why the fuck I you keep coming bro. with that damn laptop? This nigga, this nigga is New York dressed like special, my nigga. Y'all might not know who special is, but this nigga is dressed like special from New York, man. Where that, man? Let me I done, see it. I done lost it, man. I done lost it. I done lost it, man. Man, don't worry. What we talking about with the black man shit y'all said? This shit. This type of shit. Find it. Find it, Ryan, man. This nigga. I'm sure he will. This nigga was dressed like Cameron, nigga. I get it. Right, you was in pink? Nah, it's oh, worse. Okay. It's this worse? Nigga, it's worse. It's worse, man. Wait till you see this shit. Just show it to Clayton before you. I done seen it already. Check your man out. This is. What, what is that? Is that the hotel roll? Yeah. and stole a robe out the Conrad Hotel in New York and wore that bitch to the show. What are you doing? <laughs> Dog, you don't... Bro, who the fuck asked this man to bring that laptop over here? If they won't bring it up to you, we will. I what bet you, you thought you was Ghostface when you walked in that bitch, didn't you? <laughs> In my, do it, yo, guess what's okay, up? Okay, look, Ryan was down. In my defense, you can ask him. The women did go crazy. Did you open the robe? Crazy, man. Wait a minute, wait a minute, but that's, that, that's a real just hotel robe? No, 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 hell no. That was uh, Hermes. That was a Hermes robe. <laughs> Who? Hermes. Hey. The... Do what? You want to propose to your old lady right now? Now is the perfect time to do that shit. I just shut the fuck up. Let y'all do y'all thing. Fuck the show. Y'all want to get married to each other. Say what? Oh no, I'm just saying. Wait a minute, shut up. This is a beautiful moment in black history. Before you do it, bro, give us the backstory. How long y'all been together? How long y'all been together? 20 years? Nigga, you should have been did that shit. All right, do your thing. We'll sing a, a song for y'all or something. Meet me at the altar and bring our kids. We've been together for 20 years. Let's cut the bullshit. Do your thing, bro. I'll be over here. Now, I ain't coming all the way. The court ain't that long. Everybody act like we went to high school with them. All the ladies say, Woo! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Bro, what if she say no? That shit. Have... <laughs> oh, you think I'm gonna be quiet at my show? You got to. You better say it to her, nigga. Big shirt wearing there. <laughs> Miss Lady, do you want to spend the rest of your life with a nigga who wear the shirt straight out the pack? <laughs> the jeans is t is loose at the waist but tight in the legs. All right. <laughs> she gonna say yeah? Twenty years, nigga. Nigga do anything to not have that half of the rent, won't they? What she say, bruh? She said, yeah, oh! My nigga, my nigga. My nigga, my nigga. My motherfucking nigga!
Hey man, it's Nav Green from Broken Play. If you're not hip to Channel 85 app, I don't know what to tell you. But I got some good news for you. If you're not on it, right now, if you sign up and use the keyword Broken Play, I don't even know I'm able to do this. We're going to take 20% off of your first year. I don't know if I'm able to do this, but if you put in Broken Play, it's going to do that. So look, type that in, and you won't just see Broken Play for like, you know, you're going to get early access to the show. You're going to see the full show, but you also get to see 85 South Live shows. You get to see Poor Mind Live shows. You get to see Jack Thriller show. You get to see everything that the app has to offer. <clears throat> you can download Channel 85 app on any of your streaming services. That includes Apple TV, Roku, Android TV, they on Fire TV, they on Chromecast, they on Xbox, they on anything that got streaming service availability. Check out Channel 85 app. So what you waiting for, man? Type in Broken Play, sign up, get your discount, and rock out with us. Channel 85 app. Columbus, Ohio. Ohio. Columbus, Ohio. In Palace Theater. Columbus. It's Columbus. Yeah. The, what was it? The yeah. Popeye's Theater? Oh, Palace. I thought it was the Palace Theater in the Popeye's Theater. We going to the <laughs> Palace Theater. Yep. May 21st. Columbus, Not planned. Ohio. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Yeah. Bow Wow yeah. gonna be there. Yeah. And we going to shopping at Eastland Mall. No cap. Yeah. I'm, I'm going. A little bow wow. You just don't know. Then when you move so fast, hey, I got the blow. I'm gonna make all the money. Okay. Uh, I'm not uh, doing this, uh, bow wow. Yeah. Uh, you boys said, bow wow gonna pull up for me. Hey, he gonna pull up for me. All the way. Get your tickets, Snap. Get your tickets. May 21st. No cap. Ohio. Come on. Get your tickets. 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 Come on. You know what I mean? Yeah, all the way. Get the ticket. Yeah, now, hey, 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 Chad. Chad, come around here, Michael Myers. Hey, man. Hey, we, hey, how much you paying this nigga, man? This nigga just said he got an Hermes robe, nigga. And it was slug. It was it fit him perfectly, it was so slug. I know he had no, it was perfect. It was, it, was in the, it, was in, it was in the budget. That shit was tied with what? It was in the budget. <laughs> That's all you did to tie that bitch. <laughs> wow. That's it. It was in the budget, man. <laughs> this man is in his best life right now. Leave him alone. Nah, you know what it is. You know what it is. We probably don't know. It'd be somebody coming to see him. He'd be telling me, you know, yeah, watch what I do tonight, baby. Watch what I do tonight. But I'm going to fuck him up it. tonight, baby. Watch. I doubt it. I already it. know. It's going to come out. Nah, man. Next thing you know, it's going to be a group for NAV fans, and he's going to have that robe on in the picture. <laughs> They gonna be called the. Uh, they gonna be my little yeah, navigators. Yeah, you be careful. Oh, the navigators. My little the navigators. I like that. The yeah, navigators. I like it. I fuck with it. My little navigators, y'all tap in. Yeah, the navigators. The navigators. Cause nav is your name. Yep. And them bitches yeah. probably gonna look like alligators. All right. That makes sense. Oh, no. Y'all don't even see sense. how this conversation is. I was gonna say, you know what I mean? You no. bite shit like alligators. Because he already said he wanted to be on the shade room. That's exactly how I you I never said I wanted to be on the shade room. You though. did. He well, said he'd be on the shade room, like on their page. Yeah, yeah, right. like looking at the little That's shit. Probably talking on. shit. I, I, I hey, know I should want shit than these bitch ass niggas. He definitely got a burner account. I know I'm more fired than these bitch ass niggas. Man, what's your burner account? I ain't got one. Only nigga fired. Oh, got that's cat burner account. Them the only cat. <laughs> <laughs> Nav and cat. No. <laughs> hey, cat forget. Cat forget to switch pages. Yeah, cat forget to switch pages. He needs to cat the forget to switch pages. Hey, he like, hey. Brad be under the wildest hey, shit, hey. too. <laughs> cat still got the West Coast to him. Yeah, he be nigga. banging on the internet. He be like, hey, oh, water, it be 85 South Show. Yeah, bitch ass nigga, you sound like a bitch. She be like, whoa, bro. <laughs> My name I is this, this Dr. Umar Johnson you talking to, my nigga. Why would I have to be talking shit to Dr. Umar? My nigga, what he do? Hey, that's why I heard him on the clubhouse call. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, motherfuckers don't. Hey, man, this OG I mean. <laughs> <laughs> With that Corleone name, that shit come out. Hey, when he turned into Cat Corleone. Cat Corleone be on yeah. the internet going. He can't do but he can't call it yeah, over. Yeah, babe, babe, I don't want them posts where the women be like, nigga gotta tell me I'm beautiful every three hours. And, Bitch, them niggas ain't telling you the truth. I will, though. I'll be like, 85 South Show? <laughs> <laughs> Which one I said this shit? <laughs> I said Cat Corleone ain't 
switch pages, man. Fuck that. <laughs> bro, you know how many people think that's me? <laughs> exactly, bro. <laughs> hey. It be 5.30 in the morning, you might see 85 South Show just coming. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> <laughs> Can't respond to the spam box and everything. You know them little chicks who be like, am I sexy? Can't be like, I don't what know, I'm from your page. Mm, mm, yeah. I knew it was him because I ran in his voice. I was like, what the fuck, what in the page? Can't, I know it was listen, Kay. I just said it's coming I mean, I'm talking about this nigga respond to the the, the, the spam, like you said. It, motherfuckers be like that. Don't go, don't go to my page. Don't go to my page. Man, can't take my spam, nigga. Can't be like, bitch, I was already on there. You ain't no real page. Get the fuck out of here. 85 South Show. You like, bro. Now we got 9,000 spam bites. Can't won't even delete the shit. You can't delete this shit. Man, I'm working on it, man. Man, you know, I told y'all, that nigga cat got it in his basement. That nigga got nine screens up like Batman, nigga. That nigga be on everything. Man, this shit didn't get so bad. said, do you want to see my new pics? And then cat said, yes. <laughs> 85 South Show. 85 South Show. Yes. We, we ruined, my nigga. Man, I'm going to have to suspend Ken and get New Faces to do it. Hey, yeah, New Faces do it. New Faces will be, the, we'll be at the White House in two weeks. Yeah. Hey, Barack Obama said. Hey, well, nigga, who you talking to? Him. Yeah, he wants y'all to pay. sign his hat for him, man. I was just over there yesterday. Like, goddamn, New Face. This nigga, New Face was everywhere, uh, bro. I this nigga it. might work for the CIA. I think it's true. Cool. Uh, not, not as an agent, but just as a nigga they consult. <laughs> I think well, it's just true. As I a think consultant. It's, cool. it's two New Faces. Definitely. It's gotta be. It's it gotta not, be. It's not yeah. one of them niggas. This nigga is. But you say he really Two Face. <laughs> we, think, we think it's new face, but yeah, I don't want to meet the evil new face. Yeah, oh man. He probably slapped this me. This nigga just shit. collect oh, a whole bunch man. of bears. You remember this concert? <laughs> his, but his, nobody his, at this motherfucker. His mustache is yeah, real one long. That one sold boy, it's one, like, a, like an Asian man. Just one long ass mustache. That nigga be twisting that motherfucker like this. Remember your open mic from 2014? <laughs> when you bombed? When you bombed in front of your family? Why don't you sign this? Sign for me? this. <laughs> Press play. Oh, I remember the night. Press play. Press play. <laughs> I remember the night of the big fight in the club. You didn't get to go on. <laughs> Lucky you. <laughs> Hey, man. Shit is crazy, man. Oh, shit really? is crazy. Shit is crazy, man. What's some of your black man conspiracy theories? Mm. Goodness gracious, boy. You gonna take me there. Ooh, boy. Well, I done already said one. And then, you know what I mean, the only here that had motherfuckers mad at me. That, that slavery Give him crap shit. Uh, black man. Controversial Chico B. Uh, I'm getting one from everybody. Uh, I can host two. I believe that the black man was deliberately taken out of the households to make the black woman look at us as an enemy. Okay, so where does the black man live? Wherever he ends up. Where he lays his hat is his home. Wherever he ends up. The 70s. The 70s, so what I believe the black man was deliberately taken out of the home to make the black woman resent the black man. So what percentage of black men would you say have temporary housing in this day and age? Woo-wee! Temporary now, housing. It's a lot of that going 72%. on. 72%. We talking about- What? 72%. We talking about uh, fucking for rent? Absurd. Fucking for rent? Yeah. yeah. Okay, well then you have to say, how many niggas you think is living with a woman? Hmm? Black men. Living with a woman. Living Their all- name, not anywhere right. on the- It's her shit, he lived there. 73%. Now, if you're so negative, uh, but no, I, I feel like that high. I uh, think that's too high. I think that's way too high. What you say, probably man? say 35, 30, 30, 35. 35? Uh, Hell just no. living off women just and living and off nothing, women. Not, not living doing off, nothing. but he not helping her. Off. He helping no, her, no, but no, it's no, just in her name. No, that's a medical thing. I'm saying. I'm saying. Don't give an accurate thing. Don't do nothing. That can get contributed. That can get put out. It's dick. That's it. That's all he brings is just fucking. That's all he brings. Now, see, that's about that. That's about 15 to 20 percent. But, but yeah, I will argue saying. this. I will argue this. That is a fluctuating percentage because there was a time period where I may have been that, but I was able to transition it to another oh, I, tier. Well, I've never and another been that. Tax I've never had to but, live with anybody else, but I have had to rely on Dick. 
That's what I'm saying? Yeah, that we Wait all a minute. Been you got to put something else with so, that, because that ain't going to say Yeah, I know. You got to let me finish. That's what I, I was going to say. You, you cut me off, nigga. His own. Uh, yeah. His own. This is everybody speaking for their own. Dick. There you go. Clean this with shit. women. My oh, dick go down. Uh, I turned the dick. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, so, wait, wait, wait till they chop this up. You going to see it. His own way. Wait till Joe see this. Oh, yeah. Fuck that, nigga. Hey, yeah, let's let's put that out there. Hey, Ryan. Everybody talking hey, about man, their own you Pull that computer up and show that face like that. I'm a crazy motherfucker. That's what you don't do with that motherfucker. You got threatened, that motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, you know. I see man? how you work that yeah, night. That nigga that, got scared yeah, shit. That YouTube go flag it. Yeah, yeah you're oh, right, man. You know what I mean? Flag put what? it on the app. Yeah, you're right. You can't After, threaten you nobody. You can't threaten nobody but on nah, the internet. Just right. bleep, bleep, bleep. No, it. not even joking. Yeah, yeah you can't joke. You can bleep it. You don't understand. But you just how this said game that that's works. what we gonna do. But okay, give me one of your black man conspiracy theories. <sighs> that all the negative things that everybody outside of black men say, even black men, all the negative things that people say about black men have a real world effect on how people treat us. Like I niggas ain't I shit. That, yeah. Niggas ain't shit is is not just some shit to say. Um, yeah, that's a real destructive phrase because if they can convince our women to say that to us, and then you see the way that we get handled when it comes to law enforcement, police, business, rooms, jobs, general every, public. If you got the general consensus that every subgroup of people have the mindset that niggas ain't shit, then they, that's how they gonna handle it. Uh, and I think, like I said, I think remo the removal of the black man from the household is what made that possible. Because if you come home and see a man every day after he does whatever it is he does all day, you have an understanding and a, and a, and a, you know, a clear example of what causes him to be in whatever mood that he's in, you know what I mean? And whatever it is that he's going through, you have an example to see every day. But once they took the black man out the home, and then not just took him out the home, but provided the ability for the black woman to survive without him through Well, I can only assistance. agree with half of that, that statement. You know what I mean? Some niggas did get took out the home, and some niggas left the home. I mean, yeah, yeah. I'm not talking about that. The <clears throat> niggas that left the home have been leaving homes forever. I'm not talking but about that. But then you got to keep in mind, though, it's like some niggas, are, they not mentally ready to be the head of a household. I mean, but some yeah. niggas run from responsibility. Most niggas, a lot of niggas run from breath, responsibility. In the same breath. Motherfuckers before them wasn't really ready to be no head of no household. That's the thing you know about what I'm saying? it. You He's gotta like, figure that shit out. You have to be, you have, you you nobody's that ready. Shit out. But you yeah. have to understand. If you do it, it's on you to figure time. that shit out. Yeah, you can't duck responsibility. And that's the thing that, that I, I think that another conspiracy theory, I think that, you know what I mean, the responsibility. But there's more black men in the home now than it ever has been. I, you think I don't so? know about ever. Yes. But ever? Yes. I don't know about ever, yeah. but Look in recent years. Look it up. This last generation of, these last couple generations of black going kids up. have had more fathers than black kids have ever had. But see, had. that's the thing. I don't, when I say in the home, I don't in necessarily home. mean that you got With their mama. With their mama. In like, the home. I'm talking about just actively present in the household to where your influence is there, whether you're there or not. Because as a man, you have to be outside to make shit happen. We all have that responsibility. Yeah. But your presence has to still be felt in the household. In the household, yeah. So a lot of times, the pres you have they have no male presence in the household. Whether he's actively sleeping there or not, there's no presence of a man in the household. And you know yeah. one of the disadvantages of how this, this infrastructure is set up? I'm gonna say it because my boy in here is that it take us as black men so long to understand a lot of the way that the world works to even know that, okay, these things do have a real impact. You get what I'm saying? Where you gonna learn it from? Where you gonna learn it from? They gonna teach you You six school? or seven no. generations removed at this point. Yeah. Damn, you know, maybe they even had their finances or straight and they shit was fucked up. How they gonna that's teach the you number, financial? That's response. the number one thing. And that's you the gonna number learn one thing that broke up the family is the financial part. Right. A lot of men chose the streets because that was the only way that they could make it. And provide. You, know, and you gotta stop acting yeah. like we did not have shit. People had shit, but the People family wasn't shit. together. It wasn't a unit, so everybody picked it apart like some vultures. Right. And you know, we had some example. land, but we gonna sell it. Okay. And that's the number one. 
thing that break up the family. A little piece Everybody. of money. A good example of that is Crooklyn, the movie Crooklyn, the relationship mm -hmm. between the mother and father in Crooklyn. That show you like, as, even though it's based in the 70s, that show you the struggle that was going on because he was trying to do what he was trying to do and trying to chase a dream, but it wasn't providing the, you know, the, the financial stability that was necessary in the household and it caused him to leave and have to get put out of the household and have to come back. And, and a lot of times, you know, niggas left outside, went outside and it wasn't nothing out there for real, but the same shit, but once the 80s hit, and that crack hit when niggas went outside. They went outside and came back in the house with $40,000 and was like, you know what? Fuck this shit. Yeah. I'm out here. June 10th. What we going on? Chesapeake Employers Insurance, Insurance Arena. Arena. Ah! Man, nigga must have just bought that. That shit sound like a defect builder, man. man. Hell yeah. In Baltimore, yeah, and that's, that's in Baltimore, too. Man. That's on the Avenue. Insurance. Chesapeake Insurance. What else is it? Arena. Arena, Chesapeake is yours. I left the word out, but they got they got three bins in Don't one bill. Buy one ticket, <laughs> buy two tickets. Buy how many? Two. And get some insurance while you're at it, cause <laughs> y'all then they got the life insurance. Get a few tickets, a few tickets, and we gonna be selling hot dogs. <laughs> That's how they say it. Hot dogs. Hot dogs. Hot dogs on the avenue. <laughs> You dig it? Once well, you buy a few tickets. Uh huh. You gonna get some hot dirt. And some insurance, bitch. And some insurance. Chesapeake <laughs> Insurance Arena, Baltimore. Yes, June sir. 10th. I can't wait for Baltimore. Baltimore. Hey man, it's your boy Money Bad Mafia, man. Mr. Don't forget to tip the bartender himself. Baltimore Mellon, I will be out there May 4th. I'm bringing all the funny. I'm gonna tell you like this if you ain't got no tootin' pootin' the pootin' scoot, you ain't got no scootin' boot. We on the avenue. Pull up, man. Money back. Hey, what's up? It's Carlos Miller. I hope you're having a good day. Try some of these candles from my favorite candle brand, Good Day Scents Candle Company. They are black owned and have lots of different scents to choose from. Use my code L O U S, that's Los, and get 25% off your entire order or offer. Let me see. Oh, yeah, we got scents like vanilla, pineapple, sage. Which is my favorite, Egyptian Amber. All types of freaky shit, like black love. You gotta go on there and check them out. So when you see these candles, just know that I'm having a good day. You know, these candles have been approved by everybody that we ever presented them to, from Snoop and even Beyonce posted these on the website. This one right here, I think. So go hit the website and grab you some of these candles. You know what I mean? I feel like as a nigga, at some point in your life, you have to experience what being put out feels like. It kind of go like on your ghetto report card. Yeah. You feel like I done had that happen to me a couple times. You got put out? What? Wanda, boy, Wanda wasn't playing my motherfucking ass, nigga. Not by your mama, like by your... Well, that oh, I ain't never been able to... Because my mama put me out, I never was... I never you got to the point... see how they learn this shit at home? Yeah, I never got to the point where a woman could put me out mm. anyway. Mm. Because my mother made me go figure it out on my own. You were she, lucky enough to be taught. Bro. Yeah, she, she, she made me go figure it out, so I never had to rely on a woman. I was never dependent enough on my mother to ever have to be dependent on a woman. You know what I mean? She never allowed that shit in me. She was like, nigga, no, get the fuck on. You want to be a grown man, I'm going to treat you like one. Yeah. You don't get no key to the front door, nigga. See how you get in this bitch. Mm. So, yeah, I, you know, but that, like I said, I always say my mama raised me in reverse. All the loving and coddling and all that shit you supposed to give when you a little boy, I ain't getting none of that till I became a grown man. But that taught me responsibility. I couldn't run from no responsibility. It wasn't a time in my life where I didn't have responsibilities or something I was responsible for in my household. So when I became a grown man, I just had to figure out how to make this shit happen for myself. But I wasn't like, I gotta pay bills, nigga. Nah, I've been paying bills yeah. a long time. Nah, my mom was one of them. She gonna show you how much it costs my pops too. This what we paying, look. Get, get, get used to this is what shit costs and it's gonna steadily go up. Everybody gave me some. If yeah, we talking like about at, one, at a certain age, I just, like, I didn't never have like shit bought for me. I always had to like work for it. You gotta do something. Yeah, you always had to do something for it. We that, still talking about the teacher responsibility. Yeah. yeah, I still, we, we gotta sure? get yours. I know what his is. <laughs> what it is? Nah, I am wait. Oh, no. no. Um, everything, anything to do with the war on drugs. That's for us. Yep. It's designed too perfectly. It's set up too perfectly. It was started a long ass time ago. I'm doing this War on Drugs podcast. I learned more shit than a motherfucker fucking with these people that get people out of jail for sentences and shit. Now, this See, he shit, always got some shit going on. That's this on shit next level. Fucked up 
from the top to the bottom, bro. Like, this shit is all about money. It's yeah. all about making money. How can we get this from Free labor. Every slave they doing from... Because that's what slavery changed to. Yep. Fucking and prison. didn't abolish it. It was just... Bro, that shit is bullshit. Service. Anything to do with the war on drugs is bullshit. Drug dog, that's bullshit. Ain't no fucking dog. They can just tell you where the drugs at all the goddamn time, dog. You understand what I'm saying? Like, the dogs get excited when they only get excited. Anybody that got a dog know you get excited. If you done trained this dog to get excited when you pull somebody over, you gonna give them the tail to hit. Can't no dog sniff out different types of drugs all day. Even if you got a dog highly trained, that bitch good for two hours out the day. Like, it's a bunch of bullshit. You going to jail for some shit. We had Rick Ross here. When Rick Ross was here, he went to jail and never got caught with dope. It's so many people that got locked up that never got caught with dope, that never got caught with guns, but they going off somebody's testimony because that they just... Conspiracy. You know what and I mean? that was, and that they was, don't give a fuck. They just want somebody's the head up there. Yeah. They want the their head up there, dog. Yeah, that's conspiracy was thrown in the railroad. Even if you look at motherfuckers that don't have violent offenses that's being housed in supermax penitentiaries, it's like... You set an example. If, if outside of just what you said about the actual structure of it, what it sets as an example of just the mentality that we have as black men, where if it's a group of niggas, we'll go at it with some niggas, no matter where they from, what they look like. Touch but if them. them people come, niggas is taking off. The most gangsters of the most gangsters will right. run because that example that been set, nigga, they get a hold of your ass, they gonna put you somewhere yeah. where ain't nobody oh, ever I gonna be able one. to get you. Oh, most of the violence in the black community is perpetuated by somebody who's not even black. Somebody is instigating the violence in the black community. What are you talking about? There's an outside entity that creates violence in the black community. I believe that. And I'll tell you where I think it come from. The people who run the music industry. It's not is those people, it's the people who own those people. That's what I'm talking about, the people who run. It's, they, that shit is, the, it's, who run it. It's entertainment for them. I think that black on black or black violence yeah. is a category Django. of entertainment for Keep some. fighting, niggas. I do yeah. one better. This has become a form of entertainment for us. We done bought into that's what this is, and it ain't never been that. That's how you like, know what that we call in the culture. Yeah. The little, the little parts that that motherfuckers like, like the culture need to be filtered. Yeah. Like niggas panning for gold. All oh, this shit ain't gold. Yeah. We need to get the goddamn dirty. And when you think where they came bitch. from, niggas writing graffiti and breakdancing, it then went a whole different direction. I mean, from that. even. Yes, but even not going back that far, even going back maybe 10, 12 years ago, it was still a little like... I mean, it was there, but it was other options. Now, right. the, the only option is that it's available. I don't know what that was. Now, I'm saying, bro, somebody got a little booty call. <laughs> Damn, hi. What's wrong with it? Well, it's a, it's a, it was one of them pretty Ricky motherfuckers. Yeah, yeah you, can tell, you can tell from the way she sat on the phone, yeah. nigga. She was like, oh, oh shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> nigga, I said 2 o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what that was. She sat on that motherfucker too quick. What's your conspiracy theory, Nam? Uh, there are a lot of, uh, there's a lot of more good black fathers than bad black fathers. So you know how they, are, they make it seem like it's about a black dead beat dads. Uh -huh. I know a, I know way more fathers that's presence in their child life and helping with their kids. Than but that's the not. that's a good thing. Who determines what a dead beat dad is? Oh, huh. that's too deep. Who determines? I got another one. You can determine that shit. But I'm saying, but who is the yeah? Pro, like, is what's the, the criteria? What's the standard of being a good father? Nigga, not doing nothing. You can't be no good father. Right. You got it's, it's got to be a minimum criteria. I'm saying, like we just can't be like a motherfucker disappear to the ether and that motherfucker still he he got right. it in him. Right, yeah. but that's the if thing. If you don't put it out, if you now that you say that, let's say that you do do something, do you now not get to be considered a deadbeat dad because you do something? No, you gotta continue to do. You gotta you gotta you gotta be there in some form, shape, capacity. Okay, let's say every some figuratively speaking, right? Every every once a month, this, you know, you come pick your child up and take them out all day and spend all the money on them and take them back home once a month, every month. Are you a bad father? 
You need Depending more time. The it needs more time. Yeah. Yeah. Like, but think about it. If you like, lived at the house, you probably would still be doing the same shit. You would just. But can you live at the house? What's your position? What's your job? Are you a right. truck driver? Right. Where the fuck? When do you have like yeah, like what do you if do? You, what can you do with, when you able to be there for your child? Do you choose that over, over fuck shit? Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it's a lot of motherfuckers that choose fuck shit over, over that, that shit. And I think that's I think, a good criteria to base yeah, it on. What think, do you do? You t- the free time that you have to do whatever you want to do? Do you put and incorporate your child into that time? Yes. Exactly. Yes. That, and that. even and even if you go like, hey, this is what the fuck I do. Even if it's just some shit you like to do, then that's the bonding time with your kid. He Damn, come to do it. High, I told you. What? Bro, you know, that shit in the commercial. Yeah, the ones you put the hat on. Yeah, yeah you high. Cause yeah. you thinking you just you on QVC. Yeah. <laughs> you high, yeah, nigga. Clayton and Blue all there smoking his face. He high. They cook. He been over here in hell. Nah, he he leaned forward and then he leaned back. That nigga, <laughs> that nigga got that nose like them dogs he was talking about. He been smelling that JR cricket since they walked it in this bitch. Oh, no, nah, I ain't. That's the devil. That's the devil. Oh, shit. I do want to eat that. I pill, think though. that all statistics about black people are completely made up. I do too. I think Absolutely. it's more black people than they than they, than they, they tried make to, up. They tried to scare the fuck out of us with statistics. All black men can't dance neither. That's a fact. Especially yeah. not like my boy. Yeah. Shut your way. I know. Clayton. Hey. Oh. Oh, you know my fucking name? Wow. Oh, me. Oh, me. You don't know Jukebox. You need Jukebox. First of all. First of all. First of all. First of all. First of all, the heavier Nav get, the better his dance moves get. He finna turn into rerun in so a minute. So tell me, y'all niggas be going dancing like again? That. No, no, no. Hell no. Y'all a ten, y'all a dance no. 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 Y'all be going and battling niggas. No, my boy might be like, hold my bill. And then he just go out there and go the fuck off. Cap, you hear everybody in here? We was all, the only place I ever, we was in LA, right? What did you talk about? What dancing did I do? You did, uh... He lying. The new shit. He lying. Every day he say this every time. Bro, you was, was in the no club like this nigga. <laughs> no, 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 that one ain't gonna, oh. ain't gonna lie with you. That went out yet. He didn't do that. No. Oh, it went that out yet. <laughs> no. I thought he was doing a shoot. No. And he was like, no. <laughs> no. This his ass. Look, Nat, not, you I told you, Nav, Nav they got it on his phone. He's Hold on, wait a minute, it's coming. Nav ain't never been that brown no, no don't look there. You don't want to see oh, this. Oh, yeah, my bad. Oh. Let me see it. Let me see oh, what well, you wait got. Wait a minute, bro. Because you didn't have shit to say, but I ain't never seen no footage. Yeah, I got some this time. This nigga. Nav gave me I got some this time. Man. Look at it. But nah, like. Like, it's bro, it's not a bad thing. What kind of nigga get mad because they could dance? No. <laughs> it's the dances that, I, that you saying I'm doing. That's the problem. This nigga said I was doing the new shit. The TikTok shit. Now oh, look. Wait a minute. Let me see. Clayton acting like he don't know oh, what he did. Oh, fu- oh, nah, you know, he ain't really dancing. Look, he, Uh-oh. oh, yeah, he ain't oh, seen right, shit. Right, right, My yeah, boy, he ain't like I hit a split. Nah, Let nah, me nah, see nah, the shit. Nah, <laughs> Let me see the shit, oh, man. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but I cut it off. Cause like he don't dance if he see the camera go. Cut it off. Let me see it. Let me see it. Let me see it. Watch when he make the ugly face like. <laughs> Nigga, how long have you watched this video? Yeah. How many times have Glad you watched you have this? Glad you having fun like a motherfucker too, man. <laughs> oh, look, that when he do that? Oh, my God. God. <laughs> the culture fucked up. At least they have fun. That's why I say we got to get back to break dancing. Dance. My nigga this Clay want to break dance. dance. Look, look, everybody want to see. Everybody want to see uh, that shit, Clay. Oh, look. Yeah. Yeah, that ain't. All right. Hold on, oh, on. this nigga sleep. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> hey, 
<laughs> oh, so that's what you do. <laughs> wow, Mr. Paparazzi. We're not going to talk about your ass pointing out every celebrity you see, nigga. Every time I, hey, man, all right. That, that was that all that shit. Hell, like that shit. Hey, motherfucker. That was between us. Because what? Ass, nigga. No, no, no. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What, what, no dancing between us. Oh, nigga. no, no, no. I'm no, talking about the secret was, of him no. having the footage of Zane. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No. Shit. Now y'all no. wasn't dancing with each other. No. I'm talking about No, 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 because this nigga is using different footage <laughs> to prove his point about some shit he made up <laughs> in the first place. This nigga said I was doing the new dances in LA. Right. This nigga shows a picture of me drunk doing old dances <laughs> that in Atlanta. Atlanta. In Atlanta. <laughs> but Two no, different things. I understand what you're saying, Clay. No, don't show. Hey. But you look like you're looking for some more. Hey, man. But show like, where you was dancing. Ooh. Show That's where you stood up on the little booth. <laughs> You stood up you on the lying. You was standing yes, on the couch? Bro, no. Clay, this nigga was in there like Clay a bad I thought Clay was going to go fight somebody. Oh, I saw the look on it. I'm like, bro, bro, call now. Next thing oh, I know, they ticking against each other. Bro, the y'all whole mean. time, I'm trying to... St- you, been, you been to the hold Diamond? Hold on, hold on, you been, you been to the Diamond? Read on, read on. You been to the Diamond in L.A.? Can I talk, bro? Wait a minute, you been to the Diamond in L.A.? Read on. This nigga standing on the booth. So real quick, bro, who was in L.A. at the Dime just Why you happy? always call Rito? Bro! It's other people that was there. Rito. It's other people that Can was there. Can he talk, bro? Lex P was there. So when we was at the Dime, bro, Dre was um, there. Chico right here. Everybody and, was And Chico there. just trying to get to the bottom of it. <laughs> who, was da- who was I with and who was dancing and doing all the new dances? What what kind of dances was he doing, Rito? Whatever song was on. <coughs> uh-huh. And was they playing the new shit? Cap. I mean, they playing. I mean, they, they played all Atlanta shit. It was all Atlanta shit. Was, 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 he, hit, was he hitting the yeah and the, all that type of shit? The yeah. <laughs> what, what, what? The, the shit yeah. when they be like doing that shit. <laughs> Which one? How? You don't have this nigga. Do you have, okay, I was about to say, make sure you got this nigga. That's the same claim we talking about, right? Make sure you got this nigga on here. Oh, man. Show this shit. Look at this That's nigga. That's the claim, right? Guys, this is going too far. I know, man. This yeah, is stop. going too far. Now, yeah, now, stop, now the nigga told me the other day. Hey, what, what did you talk about that he did? That he did? Hey, that was when I was talking oh, to yeah, me. Well, you do, but yeah, that, yeah, we, but we were joking about that. You remember outside. that? Yeah. Oh, so, yeah. Oh, that's right. He was telling me. That's he was standing there was telling, telling you. me that yeah. you was doing that shit in the club. Yeah, but I didn't believe. So it. who it looked like doing it? He, he was really. Doing I was. It. I'm in the bro. car. I mean, he was doing but it. No, 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 no. I'm in the car. Yeah, he, he was doing. He's on my passenger side. <laughs> doing the margarita. He said the nigga. I'm in the car. I'm in the car. Was I not in the car? I didn't do it. You are dancing, bro. That nigga said, say, this nigga Clayton, he's Clayton in the drop top. You know, I see so, that. I already time. know how it's gonna be. The nigga gonna be like, nah, I can't go out with you because you tell. That, that nigga, that nigga <laughs> said. Now my boy not gonna dance with that one nigga. That nigga said Clayton was in the You said, I be turning people against you. <laughs> but, bro. That nigga said I he was in the club. I just said niggas not as good of a dancer as you. This is sassy. <laughs> this is way more sassy no, than No, you I were was. dancing zesty. No. You were the, zesty. The, the, the night that no, switched up. No, see, no, yeah, no. Was, no, no. no. Was, hey, man, welcome back to 85 Shots. No, no. no. Hey man, this nigga be catching y'all. You sleeping. did threaten his this life. Is, on this is very legit No, right? I, did, I did not really threaten his you life did, on did. Instagram. That was fucked up, he that took video. a sound bite of me saying, I wouldn't get mad if he get fired. I ain't said nah, that deep nah, voice. Nah, he said, changed the audio nah, tone. You said, I can't wait till they fire your bitch ass. <laughs> I'm going to be the first one there laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, motherfucker. I was like, damn. Bro, he added some audio in, like some insert, some clips of me saying on other the shit and he changed the tone. I was talking cool. I was like, bro, I can't wait. They fire your ass. Oh, when they finally fire your ass, I think I'm gonna be the only nigga who won't be sitting there smirking. I fucking hate you. Hey man, I you know what? Like I really had enough of talking to y'all, man. We're gonna interrupt this program for another program. We'll be right back, folks. Yeah. You like how we throwing this shit out there. You bad motherfucker. My dog. Man, shut your man, ass up. Now I'm gonna smack your ass this now. This nigga take <laughs> <laughs> penis footage. What's up, Larry? <laughs> 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 